uh, one major one major similarity that Judaism and Islam have is they are both very much obsessed with um, uh, certain uh, codes, certain laws. And I know Christianity also has it a little bit, but it's not as obsessive with uh, with jurisprudence and laws and certain practices as 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 the rest of them, right? Uh, but also the emphasis on belief. Now that's the something that both Christianity and Islam uh, are really obsessed with that, the belief, right? Uh, and the belief is the key. So basically, Islam takes the both the, uh, the obs is similar to Judaism when it comes to the obsession, when it comes to uh, following a certain, certain ritual, certain customs, certain laws. Uh, Islam and Judaism are very close with that. And Islam and Christianity are also very close when it comes to being very obsessed with the key, the key thing being whether you're not, whether or not you believe in a certain thing or not. Right. So in, in Christianity, it, yes, there are some customs, there are some laws that you have to follow, but at the end of the day, the question is, do you believe that Jesus, do you believe in Jesus? Do you believe that Jesus is your Lord and Savior? That's the, that's the key thing. So the belief is more important. Um, Islam, Islam mastered both of them. So Islam has a lot of rules that you have to follow, but at the same time, the whole, what makes you a Muslim is the Shahadat. You have to testify that the God is Allah is the only God and Muhammad is his prophet. So Islam has mastered both of those things. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.